A huge boost for downtown Detroit is in the works. A $1.5 billion investment will be used to develop 10 new buildings while creating job opportunities, housing, and some community improvements. Our Chris Walker joins us near Congress and Shelby downtown with the details. A new community benefits agreement will soon go before Detroit City Council that promises to give Detroit's downtown a world-class edge while making room for inclusive investments. There's been a huge effort to make downtown Detroit more attractive for native residents and new neighbors, but those developments also came with pushback from Detroiters who say more needs to be done to support the surrounding community. The Neighborhood Advisory Council signed a historic community benefits agreement that includes affordable housing, retail, and employment opportunities in District Detroit. Well, I think what was historic, when you look at $100 million uh, direct spend with disadvantaged businesses, that was something that had not been committed to in any other CBO um, uh, that had been negotiated over the years. The plan to develop 10 new buildings pledges to create 12,000 construction jobs. The deal also includes Section 8 housing vouchers, where 20 percent of the new units will be offered to low-income residents. We're talking about Section 8 vouchers um, that are now on top of the 50 percent AMI. That had never been done um, in any other CBO or development agreement, for that matter, that even City Council has ever negotiated. The community investments will produce green space, fulfill ADA requirements, and make improvements to Cass Tech High School's athletic facilities. There's going to be a lot of inclusion in this project that I think that we have not seen as much in other developments and other CBOs. And I think there's a lot of belts and suspenders there uh, to make sure that from the regulatory standpoint that they do follow through on it. The measure will be introduced to City Council Tuesday. Reporting in downtown, Chris Walker, CBS News, Detroit.